Here we have a 1960 Technofix quick service filling station. It is their item number 299, and this particular one was made in Western Germany. You can see you have the original box. It's in decent shape. You see you got a tear here. You are missing two of the smaller flaps on the opposite side on this side. Two small flaps are missing on the inside. But the box is in very good shape and it displays very, very well. The beauty is it's done a good job protecting its contents. Speaking of which, we'll open that up now. I've added some bubble wrap to protect it from collapsing. It's been there for a while, it works well. This particular one is complete. It has both vehicles, both keys, original techno fix, as well as the original stop sign. They're in this bag here. This additional padding. And even more additional padding. Here it is, you can see it's in beautiful shape. There is no rust, no dent, dents, <laughs> no dings. And you can see on the bottom, it's in beautiful shape. Cosmetically, it's a 10 out of 10. The cool thing is, I'll point this out now, when the cars come in, you can see the service man actually comes out to look like he's filling up the car or servicing them. There are two vehicles. Let's open those up now. And as I mentioned, a stop sign and the two original keys. Here's the stop sign on the original stand. Unbroken. There are the two vehicles. And there are the two keys. Okay, this, you can see there's a small hole and a big hole on the bottom of that. It's very simple, it actually goes right here. We can see the second here. Big hole, small hole. That's it, that's, that's assembling, you're done. <laughs> Pretty easy. Two vehicles, one in each color. You have a blue one with the original Technofix key and you have a red one with the original Technofix key. Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wind them up, put them on the track and you can watch the action. These cars will do about six to eight laps before it needed to be rewound. And the key is, you can hear, it's not discharging. That's because these have a clutch mechanism which stops it from rolling. That's key because when it goes in, oops, <laughs> there goes the stop sign. When it goes into these dimples, the car actually stops, but it also stops discharging, which means you can sit there idle indefinitely. But the cool thing is the second car will come up and hit one of these two triggers, <laughs> keep hitting that sound sign, to release the car. Okay, this one's wound up. I try not to wind it all the way, close to it though. And you put it down, and see the arrows? Full stop. And you see how the maid came out to service it. Now I'm gonna release, I'll try to say wind, the second car, which is again, There was that key. I'll use this one. Fortunately, you have two of them. <laughs> okay, and I'm going to put this one down right here because it has to hit this trigger to release that car. It's completely automatic once you get it all set up, wound up, and ready to go like this is now. And you basically just sit down and watch it. I'm going to put it down and... Oops, sorry, this is not wound up all the way. There it is. Now it's going to go in and it's going to release that car. It's going to roll around and it's going to release that car. This one stops. And that one goes. And then this one goes a little bit stops and stops the one. It gets released and it does this action until the platform winds down. You can see it's perfectly working. The cars have no dents. No scratches, no dings. It's a really good example of this 1960 299 Quick service filling station from Technofix. You will receive everything you see pictured in the condition you see pictured because you will be receiving this one. I thank you for your time and considerations. Have a great day.